Okay, so for this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a chat room in your classroom. It's using a website called todaysmeet.com. So just type into Google Today's Meet, and at the very top, you should get um, the right website. So if you just click on that one, and then you get to the main page, and it's really, really simple to set up your chat room. First of all, pick a name, pick a nice simple name for your classroom. And I'm just going to call it 6J, because uh, that's my class's name. And it will say, looks good if no one else is using your name. And then you keep the room open for however long you want. I'm just going to put two hours, because I want it to close in two hours after the lesson. And then click open your room. And then you'll get to this page. And you've already set up your... Um, chat room. So just put in your nickname. You mustn't have any spaces, so I've got to delete the space um, and put Mr. J in. All one um, word. Once you've done that, that's your name and you can type in a message. So for this um, next lesson, it's going to be a literacy lesson, I'm going to ask the students to think of um, synonyms or different words for nice. So instead of using nice, what else um, could you use? So type in your question, and then you click on say when you're finished. And then it comes in the um, box on the left. It's called the listen box. Now once you set that all up, all you have to do is when the students come in, they have to log in to todaysmeet.com. So if you, this is another iPad that I've used. Um, pretending we're a student, so they go on todaysmeet.com, they do need to type it into the address bar and they need to put forward slash and then whatever your um, cla class, well, your chat room's called. So mine was called 6J, so it's forward slash 6J. And then they put in their own nickname. So let's pretend this child's called Gareth. So they type it in and then they can type their message underneath. Um, and it really is as simple as that.